I'd like to introduce you to Mr. and Mrs. Zachary and Shania Strickland. Dear Shania, I can still picture the first day we met. You jumped out of your mom's truck. From the moment I saw you, I knew that we were going to have a great relationship. I still got butterflies in my stomach when I think of you, especially when I think you are going to be my wife. I never thought I would ever get married until I met you. When I look into your eyes, I see love, hope, and a future. You brighten my day when I am you brighten my day when I'm around you. You are there for me on the good and bad days, and you are there to touch my foot when I fall asleep. <laughs> Shania, as we start this journey, a new chapter in our lives, I never want to forget where we came from, where we started, and why we love each other. You are the reason why I get up in the morning. You are the reason why I push myself to become a better man. And you are the reason that I am closer to our Lord and Savior. And for that, I am forever grateful. As I close in this letter to my future wife, I want you to stop and think about all the great things we have had together, from the late night conversations we had when we first met to when we got our first apartment, and to the lazy nights laying on the couch and you falling asleep on my side. Should I just know I will always be there by your side and I will always support you on whatever you want to do. After you read this letter, you will be coming to our wedding ceremony and I will be waiting there for you and ready to spend the rest of my life with you. Until death do us part, I am excited for what God has planned for us and I can't wait to call you my wife. I love you with all my heart, your future husband, Zach. P.S. See you soon, my beautiful bride. My dear Zach, it's strange to think today is finally here. I feel like we have been counting down the days for so long. I know we've been anxious these past few weeks, but praying with you last night warmed any cold feet I had. You have everything I could ever want in a husband. I remember as a little girl dreaming of marrying someone I loved all the time and growing up. And I began praying for you as my future husband and what I wanted to be like, but God exceeded everything I could have asked for. I don't know if I ever told you this, but for the first time I've ever seen you on that stupid app, you've looked so familiar as if I met you before. Looking back at that moment now, I realize that was my heart letting me know it found its other half. We've been able to experience so much in life with each other in such a short amount of time, and I cannot wait to see what we have in store for our next chapter. I'm so thankful God created me for you and you for me. Being able to build our relationship on a foundation centered around Christ allows me to know that we have a will 
we will have a strong, bountiful marriage. I pray for a beautiful life with you. If you can put up with uh, with dried jelly on the counters and poorly folded chip bags. I love you so much. Now let's go get married. Love, Shmai. Forever could never be long enough for me I feel like I've had long enough with you Forget the world now, we won't let them see But there's one thing left to do Now that the way it has been Zach, <laughs> and I, we come together in the sight of God and these witnesses to hear your vows and to solemnize your union in the holy bonds of matrimony. God's word has declared, declared marriage is honorable in all things. It's an institution of God. It was given in his wisdom, not ours. To the groom, I say this. Will you, Zachary, standing now in the presence of God and these witnesses, solemnly pledge your faith to Shania and that you will live with her according to God's ordinance in the holy estate of matrimony? How about? And you, Shania, Standing in the presence of God and these witnesses solemnly swear to do the same. I will. Thank you. Now, as a token of these, your marriage vows, an unending, precious Zachary to bestow, you and Shania do receive this wedding ring. Repeat after me. With this ring I thee wed. This ring I thee wed. And all I am and hope to be, I freely share with you. And all I am and hope to be, I freely share with you. Now as a token of these, your marriage vows, precious and unending, do you receive this ring? I do. <laughs> Do you solemnly pledge your faith to Zachary and that you will live with him according to God's ordinance in the holy estate of matrimony? I do. Now repeat after me. With this ring I thee wed. With this in ring. In all I am and hope to be, I freely share with you with, as you receive this ring. With this ring I thee wed. What was the second part? Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> Put the ring on. <laughs> Zachary, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> I love you. I'd like to introduce you to Mr. and Mrs. Zachary and Shania Strickland. Yeah. You're the getaway car, you're the line in the sand When I go too far, you're the swimming pool on an August day And you're the perfect thing to say And you play it caught, 
but it's kind of cute. Oh, when you're smiling me, you know exactly what you do. Baby, don't pretend that you don't know it's true. 'Cause you can see it when I look at you. And in this crazy life, and through these crazy. Your every song, and I sing along. 'Cause you're my everything. Yeah, yeah. So la 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 la. So la. The first time I met Zach was about three years ago. I think it was in July. It was one of the first times she and I has actually met Zach. And I'm pretty sure I didn't even talk to you. I didn't learn your name. I didn't even look at you because out of all the boys you guys ever brought home, I never cared to meet any of them. But then, but then, I, I especially after I realized that he was a lot different than any other guys that I've met. Um, he actually wanted to be a part of the family. He actually cared for Shania in a different way that I've never seen any guy ever care for her, and so that was really nice for me to see. And I'm so incredibly happy that Shania has actually found someone like that. Um, I think we'll try to find that. And I was always been told that whenever you find the male version of yourself, that's when you find your soulmate. And I think. Anybody can look at them too and realize that they are best friends and they are meant for each other. Yes. Uh, Shania, I am so happy with the woman that you become. Uh, we're best friends. I'm so happy that you have Zach, and Zach, I'm so happy you're my brother. Uh, we've grown so much closer in this past year, and I love it. So. <laughs> you guys mean the world to me. I wish you guys nothing but happy years ahead. Love you guys. Just thank everybody for coming out. Um, like Perry Jean said, it does mean a lot to everybody here, especially Zach and Shania. Um, I'd like to say how beautiful Shania looks tonight. Looks absolutely amazing. Uh, I would definitely say Zach is a very, very lucky man um, to have met uh, the love of his life. Um, I have known Zach my entire life. Um, we went to school together. Like when I close my eyes 